On May the 8th, 1945, Nazi Germany unconditionally surrendered, bringing to an end six years of war, which has seen the tragic deaths of some 50 million people, the majority of them civilians. I remember with gratitude the bravery of our armed forces, together with those of the Commonwealth, who for the second time in less than 50 years came to our assistance. Whether it's regulars, reservists, hostilities only volunteers or conscripts, those soldiers, sailors or airmen, they have fought through thick and thin for the defence and the ultimate victory of their country, and I salute them. I also remember the civilian services, the firefighters, ambulance crews, the police, the air raid wardens, the bus, tram and railway drivers, and the others who selflessly risked their lives, especially during the dark days of bliss, to protect others and save lives. We should also remember our merchant seamen, technically civilians to whom few concessions were made, but who regularly risked and gave their lives, and without them we would surely have been starved into submission. But above all, remember the comradeship of all on the home front, who day in and day out, with strength, fortitude and good humour, simply got on with life, and often in the most trying and occasionally dangerous of circumstances. Unfortunately, we cannot, as we had hoped, celebrate the men and women who made V-Day possible with street parties or a parade. Instead, I would ask you to remember them this Friday at 11 o'clock with a two-minute silence. Thank you.